Hey guys, thanks for joining me, Jay, from the Home Gym UK community. Pleasure to have you as always, and today I have for you is this ski erg here from ADVG, a British based company. If that name sounds familiar to you, it's because I have done a review showcase on the bike erg a while ago, which you'll find down further down in the screen in, on my YouTube video. So this ski erg here is very, very similar to the Concept 2 ski erg. However, it's a cheaper alternative from the company ADVG. So in relation to the ski erg, in the time I've had it, I really enjoy the cardio based side of it. Mixes it up a bit, like the fact I can use two arms, one arm, have a little bit of fun with it. But also another positive in relation to this isn't just the cardio side of it. If you're in a home gym, I think the space size of this is better. I find it takes up less space than my bike, it takes up less space than my rower in general, and that's because the main bit is this long slender bit here. I'll put the sizes up on the side so you can read it now. Where it does take up more space is the bottom bit where you stand on. Now, that isn't to me a big deal because I have that and I can store other stuff on top of it if I need to and then move it out of the way as it appears to be sturdy enough. I'm going to say now I've not had this long enough to say the durability of it and how good the durability is but it seems like a solid bit of kit from first impressions and as a cheaper alternative to the concept too I'm quite happy with a few weeks I've had of it but I can't go for long longevity of this machine because I've only had it here a few weeks. Right, so as per most of these um, cardio machines you have your little display screen here whereby you can customize your settings and your time distance calories which is really good this one connects to your phone via bluetooth so you can control it there and as well as the kino map app oh, god knows if i've said that right but that is there on the play store which i've had a little look myself and you've got your standard up mode reset buttons now the model i've been i've got hasn't come with instructions with it um however if you were to go onto the internet you can find the instructions there So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to display some pictures of this machine up closer so you can have a final look at it. I'm also going to move it back to the space I usually have it to work out in. That way you can see what I mean about how I believe it fits into a compact gym space. The video of me working out ain't going to be that long. I don't want to bore you. But just so you can get a good understanding of the machine and how it works. And then I'll put the price up, put a link onto the website if you wish to see a cheaper alternative to the concept ski erg. Uh, what I will say is please like and subscribe to the video and as we've got a rower erg coming up from the same company, a water rower as well as a rack from a different company and a bench as well. So if you don't want to miss them videos make sure you like and subscribe. So excuse the boxes in the background, as I said I've got a lot of reviews coming up so that is what is in them and they'll be out of the way shortly. So as you can see here I've got this little space here Next to it, I have a leg machine. So as you can see, very compact space for me to work in. Right, so this ski erg, it comes with 10 different settings, which is all done with the wind resistance machine, which is very common on most of the erg machines. So this one's got one to 10 settings. What I'll do is I'll put a picture of it closer so you can see in more detail the settings in relation to that. So when I received the ski erg it probably took me about half an hour to 45 minutes to put together. Um, that was just me. I found the hardest part putting together was this top bit but once all that was on the rest just all fell in place. Uh, nice and easy and it came with all the screws and a little alum key and that was all I needed. 